Meet the world's first Kissel sized oh. dog. <laughs> Freddie the Great Dane stands at 7 feet 6 inches and weighs over 200 pounds, making him the world's biggest dog. His favorite snack is a whole roast chicken <laughs> and small children in the neighborhood. <laughs> He's also chewed through 23 sofas. Freddie's owner, a 41 year old woman who I'm sure is well adjusted and has zero emotional problems, <laughs> tells the Daily Star, quote, I've been single for the best part of four years, but I get cuddles off the dogs and I don't have to wash dirty underpants. She adds, they are children to me because I haven't had any kids. They need me and it's quite nice to be needed. That is true. It's mm. nice to be needed. Yes. Right, Seth? How many giant dogs does she have? Yeah. <laughs> She's saying they. Is the one dog several dogs to her? Well, that's that her biggest, so it's her biggest dog. That's her biggest dog. Yes. The other dogs are slightly smaller. Yes. But you wouldn't want this little digital assistant, but would you like to have a dog as a companion of this size? I'd rather have a dog, but if it's that size, it would have to live in my old apartment. <laughs> um, um, I, I think, I don't know. How often can she have sex with this dog? <laughs> <laughs> That's the thing. That's the real. That is illegal, <laughs> sir. That's yes. the it real is issue. It? Yeah. No matter how tall the dog. Uh, Kristen, what she seems to be saying that you know she chooses dogs over men. They're better companions. What do you think? I mean, this particular dog is not a dog. It's a horse. <laughs> I have a dog that's like five pounds, and sometimes he poops in my apartment, and I have to pick up his poops. Imagine what this woman has to deal with. It's like 100 times that. I wouldn't want to do it. I wouldn't know how to do that. But you know what? If she wants to do it, more power to her. More power yeah. to her. She likes a big dog. <laughs> she, 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 she suggests that she doesn't have to wash dirty underwear anymore. She still has to wash her underwear even though she owns this dog. That is it's still the rule. It is true. Who yeah, do you think she was talking about? Was I'm she talking sure. about a potential man or children? Know. What but was she I, I do think about my own dog who's 80 pounds and you know when he stands up he's about my my height. It's big dog. He's a big dog. He's not that big. He has high anxiety. And if he were to meet this dog, he would roll over and do something called submissive peeing, where they pee oh. all over themselves. And <laughs> even the, the thought of it makes me a little sad and disappointed in him. Yeah, so that's I a, should get a bigger dog. And you, you do have to, you got to clean up yeah. after a dog. It's, it's a lot of work. What's she love, talking about? I love this totally normal sized dog. I think it's a great dog. I love that dog. <laughs> and, uh, it's a wonderful creature. I'm happy. It looks like it has a lot of room to roam, too. So that's yes. Although you don't, you don't love big dogs yourself, I, do you? I sort of love small dogs. I like Pomeranians, they're my favorites. I've taken care of many of them. They eat the walls. They're dumb, dumb as a box of rocks, but my God, they're, they're the cutest things you'll ever see. It's and give them a good puppy cut. Uh, yeah, I love I love small dogs. It's a little creepy. Uh, well, you know, if I honestly, I, I will probably end up just like this woman, but surrounded by Chihuahuas and uh, Maltesers and the whole series of small things. You like the little dogs? It's just a weird. It's the it's the contrast, right? Yeah. Okay. Exactly.